The rapid rise of energy costs has raised many questions on the best way to utilize energy in our homes and businesses. The ability to generate energy from the sun using solar photovoltaic panels has led to a proliferation of properties with solar PV installs. As you can see, four of the five properties in this row all have solar PV panels installed. The system behind me on this roof I installed at the end of 2011. It's quite an old system now and its potential power output is relatively small compared to modern systems. However, we do have some real world generation data over nearly 12 years on this system and I would like to share this with you and the potential this brings to the property. Can I run my electric heating system from my solar panels? First of all, you need to understand in most properties, the two systems are totally independent. To effectively utilize the energy from the PV panels requires an understanding of how both of them work and have some flexibility in the function and programming of the heating system. However, it is perfectly feasible to utilize the energy from the PV panels to help contribute to the running costs of your programmable electric radiator system. There are several challenges as a property owner that you need to overcome to effectively utilize the generated power available to you. Firstly, if you increase the temperature of your whole heating system at a set time, obviously demand at this point will be very high as all of the radiators will be trying to bring their respective areas of the property up to temperature. This problem can be reduced by utilizing IntelliHeat's programmable electric radiators. One of the best products in my opinion is the iSense Smart electric radiator. I have installed a number of these heaters which can be controlled by the touch screen on each heater or as a whole property central heating system via IntelliHeat's app. Each of the radiators step from the eco background temperature to the comfort temperature can be staggered to smooth out peaks in demand. The next challenge in domestic property during the winter months is the time of highest demand. When you wake up, when you get back from work, this is likely to coincide with the time of day when there are low amounts of generation from the PV panels. The increase in battery storage capacity means that this can go some way to help reduce the disparity by storing any excess energy previously generated. So what does this mean in real terms? What's the financial potential of the old system that's installed on this property? Well, in the lifetime of this 3.6 kilowatt system, it has generated in excess of 45 megawatt hours of electricity. This averages above 4.1 megawatt hours per year, or at the current tariff, just under 2,000 pounds worth of electricity. Even for an old system like this, it's still a significant contribution to the property's total demand. Even during the winter months, September to March, the average annual contribution has been 1.2 megawatt hours per annum, or 576 pounds of the 2023 tariff. Imagine the potential saving from a modern 10 kilowatt system which would fit on this roof if you could feasibly save 1,600 pounds during the winter months alone. 